Hi, Dr. Katie here. I want you to know that even though you may be really successful in other areas of life and your career, your job, your parenting, maybe an awesome, awesome parent and raising great kids, really good people, your grandkids, you're there for them, you're part of their life, and you know, maybe you've been successful at developing your talents, uh, whether that's like in the arts or in uh, maybe you're a good writer or whatever that might be, right? Um, and maybe you're educated, uh, you know, got good grades, maybe you're really good at finances and you hold your household together and uh, make sure everyone gets to where they need to be on time and all the things that you're managing, right? And um, just doing a good job. Like, I know, I know that there's something in life that you're rock, you're rocking it. Um, and I want you to know that. I want to know, I want you to know that, like, I recognize that and you might not. Um, but I also want you to know that you might feel like in spite of all of that success that getting your food figured out and your weight and your health getting that figured out might feel like failing uh or like you can't yeah can't figure that part out and there's for me that felt like there, Cause I was, I was, I'm that person as far as like, yeah, always got really good grades in school. I have a doctorate degree. I'm a healthcare professional, successful career mom, uh, mom of four and juggling all the things. And, um, you know, I'm a runner. I've run marathons. I develop my talents. I'm always learning. And like, I don't say this to like to my own horn. I'm just saying that there are many areas of life where I've been on it and, um, driven and successful and meeting my goals. And yeah, I had a weight problem and I was struggling with depression and that part of my life, I couldn't figure out. And there were times when I felt like there was something wrong with me that I was broken. I thought my brain was broken. Um, you know, then there's still some times when I'm like, why can't I just have a normal brain? <laughs> why do I have a broken brain? But, um, I want you to know that like, if you feel that way, that you're not broken, you are absolutely 100% not broken. Okay. Um, learning about the brain and brain science and food addiction and habits and neural wiring and neuroplasticity has helped me understand that like, no, I have a very healthy brain, a uh, normally functioning brain that's doing exactly what it's supposed to and is designed to. It's just been hijacked. Um, when I understood that and learned about like food addiction, that made me feel so validated and so, um, not like normal, 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 like normalized it. Cause a lot of people are struggling with this issue and it's not because it's not for lack of trying. It's not for lack of willpower or self-control. It's not for lack of discipline. It's not for lack of setting goals. It's not any of that because that was me like goal oriented and disciplined and got things done and yet <laughs> my brain had me hooked on sugar and flour and cheese and foods that were bad for me um and figuring that out made me understand that ah, uh, I'm not broken just need to kind of approach my food in a different way than a lot of other people do and got it figured out. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to reach through the screen and give you a big hug and know, want you, I want you to know that there are so many things that you're doing so well and I celebrate you for that because you're amazing. Um, and you know, even if it feels like the food and the weight and the health piece is kind of still missing, it's not because you're broken. It's not because you're lazy. It's not because you're not trying. 100% I recognize and see you for that. Um, so you are whole, you are complete, you are beautiful, you are worthy. 
despite what your body may look like or feel like, what kind of health state you're in, that has no bearing on you as a person. And your, um, yeah, just your worth and beauty and intelligence and achievements and talents as a person. Um, so I want you to know that too.